Schools across the region kicked off show choir season with a singing and dancing spectacular at home in high school. Students from multiple schools competed with elaborate musical numbers featuring bold vocals, precision choreography, and glitzy costumes. News 8 Now's Shaquille Davis has the story for us. Alex, this event showcased schools as far as Cedar Rapids, Iowa. The kids even had to be up as early as 8 a.m. for their first performance. Six finalists were chosen, and from there, there was only one winner. Participants even told me that bragging rights is only a consolation prize. So here today we are hosting a Gathering of the Stars. It is a show choir competition. It is one of the largest competitions um, in all of the Midwest. There are 23 schools complete, competing here today. Cassidy Oaks has taken part of this show since she was in seventh grade. Now a senior at Holman High School, she has seen the significance of this day over the years. It's a really great place for kids to sort of discover things about themselves that you wouldn't necessarily get from like a sport because it's much more like family oriented. Tickets were $20 if you want an all day pass while preliminaries were selling for $15. Jordan Johnson performed in the show and gave a quick rundown on who the money and donations are benefiting. All things show choir, uh, risers, um, doing this whole event next year, so getting the stage set up, the lighting, um, costumes, um, traveling, and admissions for all of our competitions that we do throughout the year. Jaden Roden, representing Holman, admits the long day isn't ideal, but it can build a form of eagerness to show out. The groups, sometimes, sometimes they get here super early, so like, you're ready for them to be here and you just get super hyper and you're like ready for the performances to start and it's just like an exciting like buzz. Home and fundraiser coordinator Lynn Wegner reveals that one of her goals for today is to build the show choir community. This is an event where if you go kids cheer for other kids in other groups and other teams and it's a great way to see kids supporting other kids, not just the kids from their own school. Oaks is tight-lipped about what will make Holman's performance so special. There's a surprise in there that I think a lot of people will enjoy, so you'll have to watch the show. So the Waconia Power Company of Waconia High School in Minnesota actually won the competition. So a big, big shout out to them. But this showcase actually kicked off the show choir season. If you missed this past Saturday's event, no worries. You can catch Holman and the other schools this upcoming weekend in Alaska. Alex, I'm kicking it back to you. <laughs> All right, Shaq, thank you.